My name is Barry Amos. Uh, I live in Miramichi, New Brunswick, and the recreational activity I'm doing is swimming. Uh, I always swam growing up. Uh, it was something we did every summer. And then once I had kids, it was something fun to do with the kids. Uh, and then after my injury, um, I always knew my kids loved swimming. And I still had a desire to swim, even though my accident was in a pool. But uh, so we decided to put a pool in for the kids and for me. So that was the main reason I decided to get into it. What I love about swimming is it's great physical activity. Uh, it's something I can do outside. Uh, it's something the kids really enjoy. So it helps take up time for them in the summer, gives them something to do. And uh, it's also something with my disability I'm able to do with the kids. Uh, when I'm in the pool, I can swim around. Uh, they haul me around. And it's just another activity I'm able to do with my kids. Probably when I was in Stan Cassidy, it was just something that uh, when I was dealing with my uh, occupational therapist, the, they would ask what, what I might want to do with my kids and what activities I'd still be able to do. And I always seem to come back to swimming because I love the water. I knew the kids loved to swim. So it, uh, it was probably there that I realized that I was going to continue on with swimming. Uh, it's been an amazing impact, actually. Uh, I have a salt water pool. So the salt water uh, helps my skin. If I happen to have pressure sores, it seems to help heal my pressure sores. Uh, it, it also enables me to get in, do some physical activity. Uh, it helps me loosen up my joints, move body parts that I normally am not able to move sitting in my chair. So those are, those are the main reasons. I have three, three to four months where I just sit out by the pool, enjoy the sun. And if I want, I have the option to get in, like you said swim around and if I don't get in I even just sitting around the pool watching the kids uh, they enjoy me just being out here watching them dive and sometimes I'm a referee my two boys like to fight quite a bit so that's another hat I put on but just being able to enjoy the nice weather with my kids it makes it all worthwhile well, as, as you'll see in the video it's uh, it's there's not a whole lot to it it's just it was just a lift that I had to cut a little hole in the cement and the lift fit right down in the cement. And I have a special sling and I have an attachment that hooks to the sling. It just lifts me out of my chair and the, the sling rotates 360 degrees. So from my chair, it rotates me around to the pool. And then the, the attendants will slowly drop me down till I get to the water. And once I'm in the water, I, uh, I just gradually float out of the lift and I'm in the pool. I have a special life jacket, as you'll see, that, uh, that I have to wear that keeps me afloat. And I put something underneath my legs that keeps my legs floating. So other than that, I mean, as you're going to see, it's not, it's not a real difficult, uh, difficult thing to do. Uh, the biggest part is to get it, to get it, get it installed, and have uh, people that know how to use it. And once that's done, it's uh, it's easy as anything to get you in and out of the pool. Just because you have a disability doesn't mean you can't do things. Doesn't mean you have to stay in your chair or your bed. Get out, enjoy life, uh, especially the summertime. We only have a few months. Uh, whether it be boating. Uh, I'm able to get on certain boats that friends of mine have, or swimming. Uh, if you're not able to afford a pool, which most people aren't, go to your public pool. Uh, maybe they have lifts, maybe they have ramps, uh, maybe a friend has a pool. All you need to do is get a lift, and I'm sure your friends wouldn't mind, wouldn't mind uh, install, helping you install the lift that uh, would enable you to get in and out. But it doesn't matter what it is, summer, winter, whatever your sport is or whatever your hobby is, just don't let your disability stop you. Uh, for me, Ability in Brunswick was very important. Uh, they, uh, they enabled me, 
they enabled me to do certain things. They led me, they led me in certain directions where I had no idea where I was going. They were always there. They're a phone call away to help you, to help you find certain things. Or if you don't, if you can't do it on your own, they would do it. Uh, they come, they come to see you at your house. Uh, they have great counselors. They, uh, they'll do anything for you. And I would uh, recommend that anyone that has a disability, if you're not already in contact with Ability New Brunswick, get a hold of them, and they uh, they will be able to help you quite a bit, and uh, they will be able to do things for you that sometimes you're not able to do for yourself. Justin Marshall, Ability New Brunswick, Miramichi.